Patrick Allen, VP of AI at Unifor. And today we're going to talk about multimodal understanding. Uh, what does that mean, multimodal? That's, that's a big word. Um, well, we all know what understanding is, and uh, we've talked in previous uh, broadcasts about uh, uh, understanding language and trying to get machines to understand things that uh, we say to the machines or that we say to each other. Um, but all of that is just sort of focused on one medium, and that is the medium of language. You know, we humans often communicate by language, but as you know, we we have other ways of, of communicating as well. For example, we gesture about things. I might, uh, you know, say, hey, could you hand me that and point to something? Um, and what's interesting about the way humans interpret things is we can take that language and we can take something like a gesture like pointing and we can put those two things together into one representation. So when I say, can you hand me that, it's ambiguous. But if I'm pointing to a cup, you can take the ambiguity of that word that and combine it with looking at the thing that I'm pointing to. And that creates one sort of message in your mind about what the, that whole sort of scenario is supposed to be communicating. Um, and so humans do this kind of thing all the time where we might be taking things that we're looking at like somebody's facial expression uh, or uh, you know the, the gestures that they're making or other things that are going on in the context of the environment uh, and incorporating those into our interpretation of you know when somebody's saying something what is that thing that they're saying supposed to mean uh, or what does it infer or you know what can you infer from it um, so anything multimodal really just refers to any situation where we are taking multiple sources of information and trying to combine them into one sort of message. Uh, so another source of information might be the tone of somebody's voice. Um, you know, if you ask me how I'm doing and I say, great, you know, it might sound from the words like I'm saying great, but you take that and you combine that with the information you're getting from my tone of voice and from that, you infer that maybe I'm being sarcastic and the message that I'm trying to convey is not that I'm great, but maybe the opposite of that. Um, so these are all different kinds of ways that, uh, you know, we can take more information and incorporate it with language and try to create a, a machine understanding system that understands something more in the way that people would understand it when they're talking to each other, taking into account uh, things like the emotions that people might be conveying um, and that sort of thing. And that's something we'll, we'll talk about uh, at a later time in a little bit more detail. Um, but for now, uh, I just want to sort of communicate what, what is it that we mean by multimodal uh, understanding, uh, and I hope you've got a, a better idea of that now. So uh, next week we'll, we'll talk about something else, and uh, until then, uh, be well. Ciao.